Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Now before we start our video, let's try to understand three important terms which we will be repeating quite frequently in our discussions. These are SIG init, COM init and EL init. SIG init or signal intelligence refers to any intelligence gathering method that involves the interception and analysis of signals emitted by enemy communication systems such as radar and weapons. SIG init plays a vital role in national security by providing information needed to see into adversaries' capabilities, actions, intentions, which in turn help military personnel stay vigilant of current and future threats. There are two categories of SIG init. First is COM init and second one is EL init. COM init or communication intelligence refers to any intelligence that is gained from communication between people or group. It refers only to signals that contain speech or text such as text messages or telephonic conversation or radio conversation or any kind of online interaction. Now L in it or electronic intelligence refers to any intelligence that is gathered from electronic signals. In other words, only non-communication intelligence. So it includes radio or electromagnetic pulses and signals that are emitted from radars, missile guidance systems and aircraft. Now talking about the special mission aircraft, they have unique unmatched intelligence collection capability which could be a game changer in advent of high tension with adversaries. The special mission aircraft can perform different roles such as signals, intelligence, maritime reconnaissance or airborne early warning system. During Aero India 2023, DRDO has showcased three important special mission aircraft. These three platforms are SCA that is Signal Intelligence and Comjam aircraft, ISTAR that is Intelligence, Surveillance, Targeting and Reconnaissance aircraft and MR, MR which is Medium Range maritime reconnaissance aircraft and it is also called as triple ma that is multi-mode maritime aircraft in today's video we'll keep our discussions about sca and in upcoming videos we'll talk about i star and triple ma in detail based on our discussion with the drd officials during aero india 2023 during aero india 2023 DID has showcased one S-232 scale model of SCA aircraft which you can see in the video. The platform proposed for this aircraft is the pre-owned Airbus A319. The aircraft is going to be a long endurance multi-mission aircraft capable of performing SIG init and COM init functions. Its primary role is going to be passive intelligence gathering and signal jamming. In COM jam role, the aircraft will perform jamming of the radio frequency signal based on the signal data collected by the aircraft's L init and comet assets and even it can receive data via Indian Air Force IACCS network. The aircraft will have a flight altitude of 35,000 feet and endurance of 6 hours. It will be integrated with state-of-art COM init and L init sensors with very high sensitivity and high probability of interception. The sensors will be capable of performing high-speed scan while flying in the sky and search for the radio frequency signal within the frequency range which is programmed or desired. So once the sensor is able to detect the desired signal, its direction of arrival or emitting location is determined with the help of artificial intelligence. It then quickly determines the geolocation of the target and after finding the location of target, it automatically jams it. The aircraft is also able to maintain continuous communication with ground station via line of sight and SATCOM data link. For its self-protection, the aircraft is integrated with radar warning receiver, electronic warfare support measures, missile approach warning system and countermeasure dispensing system. As per our discussions with DRD officials, the proposal for SCA and COMJAM aircraft has been given to government. The funding approval is awaited to formally commence the work on the same. Back in the year 2017, Indian Air Force has released an RFI for seven airborne electronic intelligence or L-init asset at a cost of $570 million. 
the LNET platforms are to be used for signal intelligence, communication jamming capabilities, electronic warfare, and spoofing during hostilities. The DRDO's new SC aircraft completely fits to this requirement of Air Force. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.